Can you use a consumer digital camera with an infrared filter to uh, find out where your leaks in your house are? I think it's worth a try. I don't know. Andrew, do you have any insights on this one? That's a question I haven't gotten before. Yeah, me either, and I'd be interested. Let me know what happens. <laughs> these infrared cameras, these infrared cameras are typically fairly expensive that these contractors have. You know, they'll spend I, some of the cheapest, the lowest cost ones I've seen. You know, are between five thousand and seventy-five hundred, and at one point they were almost eighteen, twenty thousand dollars for these cameras, infrared cameras that you can scan walls in and see if you can see the insulation or not, and really see what's going on in the house. I mean, if, if the, I mean, the technology's coming a long way these days. If there's a digital camera you can put an infrared, you know, mechanism on and it works, I'd be, I'd be really glad to hear it. I know the contractors would love it. Yeah. Um, it Thanks, Andrew. It's sort of, uh, it, it's sort of, I think the sensors pick up infrared and you have to filter out the other light so that you just get the infrared picture. The picture looks, uh, the trees look white. It looks like a true infrared picture, uh, visual well, then picture. It, you know, give it its best shot by waiting for a cold night and um, take, are there any, let's see, do you want to do this for your above grade walls or basement walls? I can't remember what it was. It doesn't matter. Okay, then wait for a cold night and get out there and then, then uh, shoot it at your house. 